The 2014 USA South Athletic Conference Hall of Fame took place on May 4th on the campus of Methodist University in Fayetteville, North Carolina. The USA South was pleased to induct four former student athletes, one former coach, and one former administrator. Patrick Daly was a three-time first-team all-conference performer while starring on the Ferrum College baseball team. In 1998, Daly was named Conference Player of the Year, collected all South Region team accolades, and earned first-team All-America honors as he led all of NCAA Division III in slugging percentage, along with the per-game average categories of home runs, runs batted in, and runs scored. Additionally, during that spring, he was listed as one of the toughest to strike out in NCAA Division III with just 10 strikeouts during the season. Daly was a two-time conference all-tournament performer and ended his career with a 399 batting average. Daly spent a brief time playing professional baseball in Ohio after his time at Ferrum had concluded. In 2010, Daly was inducted into the Ferrum College Athletics Hall of Fame. Uh, very humbling, a lot of gratitude, I'm glad to be here today. I really wished all of my uh, teammates could be here with me to receive this honor because it was definitely a team effort, and so I'm looking forward to it. Jansen Evans was a captain on the first Methodist University baseball team to reach the NCAA Division III World Series in 1986. He was a three-time all-conference performer and a two-time first-team All-American. Evans helped lead the Monarchs to the NCAA tournament in each of his four years on campus. He currently is the NCAA Division III career record holder for runs scored with 267. Additionally, he holds the conference and Methodist career records for games played, at-bats, runs scored, hits, and triples to go along with seasonal records for runs scored and triples. In 2001, he was inducted into the Methodist University Athletics Hall of Fame. I think it's a great honor. Um, something that was totally unexpected um, to be recognized with your peers is, is, you know, with your dedication and your desire to perform and do well in college. It's been a great experience. Uh, lots of people have helped me through this process and supported me throughout my college and plan days. Uh, which is, it was certainly helped me to do my best and be my best at all times. Um, this is a great honor. I'm certainly happy to be inducted into the Hall of Fame um, with a distinct group of individuals. Thank you. Rob Paluski was the 1990 NCAA Division III men's golf national champion while a member of the Methodist University squad. Also during the 1990 championship, Paluski helped the Monarchs capture the program's first ever men's golf national title. Methodists would go on to capture the following two national championships in 1991 and 1992, greatly helped by Paluski's performances on the course. He was a four-time team most valuable player and is currently one of only two Methodist men's golfers to earn All-American accolades four times. In 1990, Paluski was named Methodist's Athlete of the Year. In 1992, he represented the United States as a Division III delegate for matches versus Japan. In 1998, he was inducted into the Methodist University Athletics Hall of Fame. Well, a tremendous honor, obviously, and uh, what, what a great class to be inducted with. Um, certainly overlapping with uh, Ann and Coach Pereira. Uh, just, just a wonderful day and, and tremendous honor, so thank you so much. Ann Thorpe, a star on the Methodist University women's soccer team, is the institution's only four-time NCAA Division III All-American in a team sport. Thorpe started for three Final Four teams and is currently Methodist's and the USA South's all-time career leader in both points and assists. She was a three-time All-Conference honoree and earned academic All-American status during three consecutive campaigns. In 1990, Thorpe was named the conference's Player of the Year. In 1998, she was inducted into the Methodist University Athletics Hall of Fame. I feel very privileged to be here today, um, 50th anniversary of the South Conference. Um, I'm here with my coach, which makes it even more special to me, Joe Pereira. He was there for the full four years I was. Um, it's a great individual honor, but I really think I'm accepting it on behalf of the four teams that I played with when I was here. Um, you know, it's a team sport, someone's got to get you the ball. Um, I enjoyed my four years here tremendously. Um, a lot of good memories here today, and uh, I'd just like to thank the conference for the honor. I feel very honored. Thank you. Joe Pereira served as head coach of the Methodist University women's soccer program for 11 seasons. He is the winningest coach in program history, compiling 144 wins. 
Pereira was named Conference Coach of the Year seven times, the most of any women's soccer coach in conference history. He led the Monarchs to eight conference titles, seven NCAA Division III tournament bids, and three Final Four appearances. During his tenure, Pereira's players earned 44 all-conference honors and 19 NCAA Division III All-American accolades. Pereira became the head coach at Old Dominion University in 1995, a position he held for 19 years. He led ODU to the program's first ever conference title and was named Conference Coach of the Year twice. In 2000, he was inducted into the Methodist University Athletics Hall of Fame. Well, this is a special recognition. Uh, this is a uh, validation of 33 years of work and, uh, and certainly the uh, Conference USA South. Uh, the beginning for the first 14 years of my 33 years being here, it was uh, yeah, it's extremely special and important to me to because it represents so much. It represents so much work and so many people, and, it's, and yes, really what it does, it validates all that history. Vesa Hiltunen served Avert University in several capacities for 28 years. Hiltunen was the men's soccer head coach for 13 seasons, the head men's tennis coach for 28 seasons, and the director of athletics for 23 years. During his time as head coach, his teams captured 12 conference championships, 9 in tennis, and 3 in soccer. Hiltunen earned the title of Conference Coach of the Year nine times and South Region Men's Tennis Coach of the Year twice. In 1981, he was named Director of Athletics, and during the 23 years in that position, Hiltunen added eight athletic programs and oversaw significant upgrades to Avers fields and facilities. Prior to arriving on campus, Hiltunen served as YMCA Program Director in Helsinki, Finland, and Queens, New York. In 1998, he was inducted into the Avery University Athletics Hall of Fame. It's fantastic, and uh, you can hear my foreign accent. I told them I will never do it, but in this country, it doesn't matter what background you have. And I have so many friends who helped me to achieve this honor, and I, I'm just thrilled.